What is going on everybody? Welcome back to Phones and Drones. So, shockingly enough, we're back to talk about this baby today, and more specifically, Android 14 Beta 5.3. Shockingly, Google actually released another dot upgrade for Beta 5 for Android 14. This is now the third time we thought this would be the last version or last pre-build number before stability and before the public release. As we discussed in our September Pixel video, well, Google made that based off Android 13. So we knew we weren't going to get Android 14 yet. There's rumors now it might actually hit for the first time on October 4th, which is the same day that the new Pixel 8 series will be dropping and it will mark a first time Google has not released the most recent Android build earlier than the actual new hardware. So having said that, quick video for you guys today, just installed it. Let's take a look at the build numbers and what was fixed. Let's go. So jumping right back into it, as you can see here, courtesy of Droid Life, I wanna just go over these features really quick on here and then talk about the build number and how it's been operating for the last day or so. So as you can see here, this is more so not just tailored to the Pixel Fold and Pixel Tablet like Beta uh, 2 was, or 5.2 I should say, excuse me. Uh, this has a ton of issues with the actual <clears throat> system level. So the first one on here out of the nine main bullet points is fixed an issue where apps crashed in some cases after a call style notification was posted, fixed various issues that could cause call or carrier service interruptions, fixed an issue where the system was using an inefficient path when placing CPU restrictions on apps running in the background, fixed an issue with Surface Slinger, fixed an issue on the Pixel Fold and Pixel Tablet devices where the taskbar sometimes turned invisible while interacting with it, fixed an issue on, again, the Pixel Fold and Tablet devices where the animation or animated wallpaper stutter when launching apps, fixed an issue on the Pixel Fold devices where the interface layout was misaligned when customizing the home screen, another Pixel Fold update where the clock on the lock screen was flickering when animating, and fixed various issues with, uh, that were impacting system stability and performance. So, yes, obviously, again, there were a couple of tweaks specific for the Pixel Fold and Pixel Tablet, but again, this was released from the Pixel 4a all the way up to the Pixel Fold and the Pixel Tablet, and what I can tell you from actually using this build now for a couple of days, this has been awesome. We really didn't have any issues with Beta 4, or excuse me, Beta 5.2, uh, and we definitely are carrying that over here. So jumping right into it and going into settings and to check out the system and all of that. So you can see we are running still the August security patch, Android 14 obviously. And then if we wanted to go into the about and look at the build number, you can see this now has a build number of UPB5.2306 23.009. I believe beta 5.2's build number was 0 .006, so just ever so slightly improved. Uh, I can tell you the device actually got a little warmer than usual during the upgrade process, but it went right away, and the actual download and install of the update was much more timely than what we have had in the past. Again, the way Android updates if you follow the channel, you know, we're beating a dead horse. We hate the way it works. We'd rather something along the lines of how iOS updates. Yes, we understand your phone's not usable during that time, but I much prefer being able to knock it out than actually have to uh, wait for, you know, two hours for a 22 megabyte file to install. But yeah, quick video again for you guys today. Now you know, go pick up that update. It should be an OTA file if you're in the beta, or you can obviously load it differently as well manually. Let us know what you think in the comments down below. Are you excited for Android 14? Thanks for watching, guys. We'll catch you in the next one. Peace.